This is hook, line, and sinker of Cosby Cabins in Cosby, Tennessee. We are next to Newport and about 44 minutes away from Pigeon Forge. There is an adjacent cabin. They share a deck that goes out and leads to the Cosby River. Hook, line, and sinker also has a nice hot tub that is locked. So if you're here and you can't find the key, it is usually behind the front door on the key rack. They do allow fishing from the Cosby River. Kids 13 and under can fish for free. They have park grills and two picnic tables out in the back and a couple fire pits. It's a really, really nice cabin, guys. Beautiful. If you like fishing and you want to bring some kids fishing, I highly suggest coming out here. The uh, creek isn't really that deep, maybe two to three feet. I'm not sure about the deepest areas, but it stretches nicely. You are in a residential area. There is a uh, couple that lives next door. They got dogs, but they have an electric fence. The dogs didn't bother us. There's uh, plenty of wooded area around if you like to hike or whatever. It's a really nice area. All right, guys, let's go inside and look at the cabin. All right, let's go in. Through the front door, we are going into the kitchen. The kitchen is well stocked. They have uh, all the knives and forks, spoons, cooking utensils. Cabinets come stock. It's got plates and bowls. Everything you need for a weekend getaway or even a week stay if you want to cook. Glasses and coffee cups, toaster, coffee pot, got a stove, oven, microwave, refrigerator, freezer. Nice center island, and the center island is kind of your table. It does have bar stools that come out, one on either side and two in the middle. And they have two extra over here if you have more than four people. But it's an open floor plan. Uh, from the kitchen is, of course, the living room. You've got uh, two leather recliners, and then you have a couch. It is not a couch bed, but it has recliners on either end. There is a gas fireplace and a big screen TV, and it looks like they have Dish, Dish Network, so you won't miss any of your games. First bedroom is off to the right. It's a queen size bed. Bed is not that comfy in this room. It does have its own bath with shower, and a door that leads back into the kitchen. So that's kind of a, odd setup but that's what that one is they uh they come stocked with pillows and comforters and they have some extra pillows and blankets if you need them nice little suitcase rack in the corner and then the uh, adjacent bedroom is very similar to design queen size bed they said this bed was more comfortable than if you stayed with us they slept in it another place for your suitcase they got extra pillows and blankets over here and this bathroom has a shower tub combo. Again, everything was stocked, had what we needed for a weekend getaway. Very cozy little cabin. We enjoyed our stay. It is kind of a, was kind of expensive for the weekend. I don't know what's going on in Pigeon Forge. We're 44 minutes away. And this cabin was $800 for this weekend. Guys, this is a hook, line, and sinker of Cosby Cabins. We're, uh, again, kind of in between Newport and Cosby, Tennessee. 44-minute drive to Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg. Had a good weekend, had a good time. Uh, I, I would rent this cabin again. It's, it's a nice, cozy little cabin. The price would have to come down. I wouldn't, uh, wouldn't do it just for a weekend getaway for me and the wife. But. This was a special occasion and it's about all we could find. Guys, this is Jason for Man's Adventures. Um, subscribe to my channel. I do hiking, camping, and travel. I try to bring you uh, what I do when I do it. And 
I appreciate everything y'all do. Subscribe, like, and share. See you on the next one.